distant land. I, Aku, the shape-shifting master of darkness, unleashed an unspeakable evil. But a foolish samurai warrior wielding a magic sword stepped forth to oppose me. Before the final blow was struck, I tore open a portal in time and flung him into the future, where my evil is law. Now the fool seeks to return to the past and undo the future that is Aku. Hey guys, Mighty Gazelle here with more Samurai Jack content. It's been years, but I am so excited to play Samurai Jack Battle Through Time. It just released today. I have done my absolute darndest to avoid as much gameplay and spoilers about this game. I have absolutely no idea uh, where, this where this game takes you, but I am so excited. The fact that this game was announced not too long ago and here we are being able to play it. Uh, I'm so excited. I'm gonna be doing a full let's play of this game from beginning to end. Um, and wow, look at this wonderful art on the beginning screen. Wow, absolutely awesome. Uh, so let's just dive on in. Uh, diff difficulty level, I'm assuming, okay, <laughs> Jack is the easiest one, nice. Samurai, Master Samurai, Master of Masters. Okay, so I'm gonna just do, just do this on the normal difficulty. Uh, I'm sure on my own I'll do uh, the, the ones below. Um, I'm probably going to 100% this game if I'm being honest, I'm just so excited to play, but for the, for the time being, let's just do regular. Oh my gosh, guys, I'm so excited. They brought back a lot of the original cash for this game, and the, the gameplay looks so much fun from the little bit I've seen. I am just ready to dive on in. Should be a great time. Oh, nice. Okay, so this is the last episode of Season 5 we're getting footage of. By the way, I have heard that uh, I might get a copyright claim because of this intro. I haven't seen the intro myself, but um, they said it's not a huge deal if you dispute it, so we'll see how that goes. I'm, I'm gonna include it because <laughs> it's Jack and Ashi and Aku. Why would, I, why would I dare get rid of it? No, and he never will be. How dare you talk back to your father? No, you're not my father. Yes, I am. <laughs> no, you're not. Dude, it feels like such a long time ago that we got uh, the finale of season what? five. Ashi, you have Aku's powers. I do. <laughs> I guess I should have mentioned spoilers for anyone who hasn't seen season five. <laughs> but I mean, that's kind of self-explanatory. Oh no! Oh, here we go! Oh, it looks so good. I love I love this style. Oh crap, here we go. Jack? Jack? <laughs> I'm getting some major like PS2, GameCube like vibes from this game. That's kind of good. I kind of want that. Um, like a modern take on an old type of game. Aku's minds. I'm back in the past. But wow, dude. Not where I should be. Ashi. Ashi! Help! Ooh, help! I say. Sir Rothschild, baby. Rothschild. But I saved you in the future. Oh, cool. I must Beetlebots, baby, let's go. <clears throat> Auto save, okay. Alright, so I slash with square. I'm playing this on PS4, by the way. Not sure that matters, but. 
Cool. Okay. Self-explanatory. What does he drop? Coins. All right. So cool, dude. <laughs> Blake Stabry Jack. Yes. Uh, very quick impressions. Uh, love the art style. I, they actually went really kind of all out. Not all out, but I mean, like they they did a good job with this level design. And uh, yeah, I just. <laughs> Again, I have no idea what this game's really like outside of a little gameplay that I watch, so let's just kind of go. Yeah, this, I'm definitely getting some early, like, PS2 GameCube vibes in terms of, uh, like a 3D type of beat-em-up slasher, uh, action game. That flag should be familiar to you guys. That's, uh, I think that was, like, episode 3, I think, when Jack helps fight uh, the dogs fight off the Aku Beetlebots. Classic episode. Oh my gosh. I'm <laughs> Let's go. Okay, so strong attack. Triangle. Let's try that out next. I don't know if there's actually like combos and stuff, but for the most part, I imagine this is kind of just helping him up. <clears throat> I wonder if I can break his block with this strong attack. Okay, so these guys are hurt once, just like the show. Not very impressive. Also, I'm going to keep my eye out for hidden stuff. Typically, the games like this, they love to have little hidden stuff to collect, which is awesome. And there's no double jump. Maybe I unlock that later. Sorry if I just, like, ramble. I'm just, my mind's all over the place. I've been looking forward to this game for so long. Uh, skill fire. Use skill fire to learn upgrade skills. Some advanced skills require Bushido and items to unlock. Okay. <coughs> <clears throat> Let's see if I can find uh, what they were just showing off. Okay, so we found a little bit, I think, right there. Okay, succession to deliver combos. Okay. Dama. Dama is an otherworldly presence that grants benefits in combat. Uh. The white one restores health, red increases strength of attacks temporarily, and blue fortifies defense. Okay. Looks like I got a brief power-up from that guy. Uh, Kiai Fire. Collect fire to unleash a special Kiai attack. For each weapon type, when the flames are full, activate the attack by clicking L3 and R3. Okay. I'll try that out in my next uh, fight, I guess. Oh, right now. So all that seemed to do is lock on to the opponent. Okay, maybe I don't think I have it unlocked yet. That's probably why. Yeah, by the way, uh, for anyone who's curious, this game's actually canon. Uh, from what I've been told in terms of the Samurai Jack lore and story. And what I'm really hoping for, I don't know if we'll get it, but I, I don't necessarily want the ending retconned like a lot of people do. I actually am kind of okay with the fact that, again, spoilers uh, for anyone who hasn't seen Season 5. <clears throat> I'm actually okay with Ashi dying. Um, my main quarrel was that uh, the ending with Aku kind of felt a little lackluster. And I'm kind of hoping we get a great final confrontation in this game to compensate for that. Uh, since this is canon and all that. Um, but... Okay, so... Your gi is torn each time damage is taken. That's the old trope for <laughs> Samurai Jack. <laughs> uh, his shirt always comes off. Uh, okay, so... Alright. Good to know. Um, so yeah, the, so clearly we're back in, like, episode, season one like episode three or something right now. So we're definitely gonna be going through time, like the title suggests, and going through all these uh, old episodes of the show, I guess. Uh, if that's the case though, I'm really, really looking forward to what they chose to put in this game for levels. You know how cool it would be to get a, a Tale of X9 mission? Maybe he can finally save Lulu? I don't know, like, I mean, I, again, I'm completely blind. I have no idea what this game has to offer, but, uh, yeah, I'm just, I'm just so excited. This is great. Click that button to, well, not in combat, to focus the camera on the next objective. Okay. Cool. 
So yeah, they, uh, this doesn't really feel like a super modern game. It's very much kind of uh, GameCube PS2 generation of like, oh, there's collectibles and like you just slash at enemies and 3D kind of platformer action, which is awesome. Like they don't really make games like this anymore. So I'm definitely excited to play this. Uh, upgrade skills from the skill tab and the pause menu. Okay, uh, see if we can equip that right now. Oh, we can. Oh, wow. <clears throat> cool. Combat, spiritual, and physical. I love the image on the right of Jack uh, meditating from Season 5. That's great. Focus inward to learn and upgrade spiritual being an inner balance. One must attune body and mind to learn and upgrade physical skills. Weapons alone cannot defeat your enemy. Learn and upgrade combat and fighting skills. So let's go with com- wait. Oh, we need- okay, we need to do spiritual first, okay. Alright, so it looks like we won't be able to unlock a column until you start that column. So that's interesting. Uh, Ki attack. Okay, so we didn't have it unlocked, that's why. Um, let's go ahead and unlock this one. That's our ultimate that we had. Uh, it doesn't look like we have any more points to use. Oh, we, we have more points to use, but not enough, so. Alright, well, we unlocked our special attack. Let's do this. Oh, dude, that's awesome! That's awesome, man! Yeah! <laughs> Just like auto kill them all. <laughs> Let's go! That's pretty cool. Um, that attack alone took out like, I don't know, three or four of them. Now I'm just like uber powerful right now. I'm not uber powerful, but I mean, I'm Jack, baby. I'm always powerful. The forces of Aku have stand no chance against me. Ooh, this. But what do you know, the last guy is the one that hit me. Oh, that's so cool! Dude, I love Samurai Jack. I just, I just love him. I love, I love this universe. I love the style. Let's go, dude. Hope you guys enjoy my Let's Play. I don't care if five people watch it or a thousand. I am just so excited. This is my inner child right now. I'm so happy. Um, for anyone who doesn't know, like, literally my channel kind of took off uh, with Samurai Jack. Uh, unfortunately, most of those reactions are gone off YouTube because they were claimed by copyright and stuff, but uh, I still have all the reviews and stuff of the episodes and whatnot that are still up and Like that's kind of how I got my start on YouTube. So Samurai Jack means a lot to me I mean not only just because of YouTube, but it, it was like my favorite cartoon as a kid, so <clears throat> Rothschild, hey Be careful, old boy. Cool <laughs> Deja vu trophy. I'll have to check out these trophies later. Huh, interesting they didn't have these these scenes voiced. A Scotsman, the swamp ahead. Nice. Oh no. Is he like possessed or something? Hot water. Simple hot water. Using this restores health by a small amount. Okay, so you have items. How do I... Okay, so that's block. It's good to know. Uh, how do I use items? Oh, I have a dash. I'm surprised I didn't check this out earlier. Uh, oh, okay, so you just press start and go to items. <laughs> look at these! Look at these uh, images on the right. It's awesome. I'm pretty sure these are new. Those are n new pieces of art. That one looks new, and that one might not be new. I guess. Uh, so yeah. Oh, and there's a record too with the, with the runtime and everything. Wow. Oh, quick equipped. Okay, so you can actually equip stuff with the D-pad. Can I put that on the D-pad right now? Okay, there we go. Let's put that in the left D-pad. Uh, corrupted Emperor's Cayman... Uh, Camon, I guess? They must be destroyed. Okay, so this must be the collectibles, that, that orb thing I destroyed. Good to know. Gold is used to train weapon types, repair weapons, and purchase items from the shop. Have I seen... Did I see a shop in here? Weapons. Samurai fist. Okay, so I can. Okay, I, I have the fist unlocked right now. It's cool. Mastery of Shaolin Kung Fu turns fist into destructive force, making easy work of brittle enemies. That's awesome. Uh, the unbreakable. Yeah, I was about to say like it'd be really, really weird if Jack's sword. Uh, you had to repair it. It's good to know that that is not the case. <clears throat> it's kind of cool with the other weapons though. But if I'm being honest, I think the sword is going to be what I'm going to rock most of the game. I'll definitely try out every weapon as we go. Hold on, did I miss... I think I missed something up here. Can I go up this? 
That doesn't look like I can go in the foreground there, or the background, I should say. That's interesting. It goes from like a 3D platformer to like kind of a side scroller. That's pretty interesting. Yep, this is it. This is where we meet the Scotsman. Back in season one, I think? We fight like the Gators. Yeah! Yeah! Okay. Nice. I mean, technically we fight him with the Scotsman, but he's not here right now. He's He was just mentioned though, so maybe we'll run into him. All right, bring it on, Gators. Challenge begin, Crocodile Hunter. I like that Steve Irwin reference, that's cool. Um, okay, wow, you get challenges, that's so cool. Dude, okay, I'm 100%, 100%ing this game. I cannot wait. Uh, by the way, I, uh, I don't know how long this game is because it's only like four and a half gigabytes on PS4. And if you own a PS4, you'll know four and a half gigabytes for a game is not much. Now, maybe that's because this game has such a simple art style and whatnot. Okay, how do I get in close to these guys? Gotta dash a little bit. Alright, I'm gonna have to use my block and dash more against these guys. They're not like the Beetle Jones. These guys actually have guns. Uh, before I go that way, let me just check for collectibles. I don't know if they'll be hidden in any crates. So I'll just have to keep my eyes peeled for him. Okay, I should probably go for the guys with the guns first. They're definitely the most trouble. I mean, I, I say most trouble. It's not exactly that hard, but you know, you know what I mean. Okay, cool. Treasure chest unlocked. Zelda style. <laughs> I don't know. I don't know. I can't mimic the thing. I'm so sorry for butchering that, Zelda fans. <laughs> Kaiken, a single-edged throwable dagger. I get ten of those. Okay, I might as well equip them. I guess. Uh, yeah. <laughs> I like how it's telling me to equip it, and I've already kind of done that. Uh. Oh, whoa. Okay, hold up. Activate. I don't want to use the Kai attack though. Um. How do I put it on my wheel? Uh, how do I throw it? Do I have to use this attack? Is that why I told me to do that? Nope. Okay. Hold up. Oh, okay. So you just click R2. Okay. <laughs> I, well, I wasted my ultimate attack there. That sucks. Oh, well. Why is this spot glowing? Is that a glitch or is that just is there something here? Whatever. I'll worry about it later. <clears throat> Very cool, man. This brings me back. I'm sure a lot of you guys who are younger, um, like if you if you if you're like 12 or whatever, you might be like, this game does not look good. Like Fortnite looks better. I don't know. I I think this is very charming. And <laughs> look at this, dude. I'm just having, I'm just having so much fun. I, I could beat up a hundred crocodiles. I wouldn't care. This is great. Bring them on. Come on. Oh, whoa. Okay, there we go. Mixed in a combo there. It's telling me I should learn a new skill. I'll do that in a second. Got to collect all this gold. Oh, wow. Is that guy shooting me from way over there? Holy crap. Oh, there's one of the collectibles. I wonder how many are in the game, or in each level. Uh, let's try to learn a new ability. Skill. Increases, increase in probability of item drops from defeated enemies. That could be good. Can I do... I can do these ones, okay. L1 at the right as the enemy attack is about to strike and block and counter the enemy. Okay, that's pretty good. I might want to use that. Uh, press L while moving to the side and guard enemy assault. Attacks while sliding for a homing attack. While sliding for a homing attack. Rushing guard. That could be kind of good. I think I might... I think I might do that. Let's do... Let's run this one. I can actually learn more. I have a lot of uh, stuff to use. Oh, double jump! Yeah, we're, we're getting that. 
Oh, I can grab and throw them? Dude! Okay, wow. There's some cool stuff in here. Decrease in enemy... Uh, decrease in damage received from enemy attacks. That's pretty good. I might actually just take that. Actually, I don't have enough for that one. Let's do the throw the enemy one. That's awesome. Okay, so I can... I can do a lot of stuff now. I can dash. Double jump, baby. Yeah, that's kind of cool. It's not a super high double jump, but... Uh, let's try throwing this guy. Okay, so that's cool. It's not really much of a grab, more of like a... Oh, there we go. There's the grab. Nice. Okay. So we have that guy up there. Throw a knife at him. Oh, whoa. Oh, that's cool. There's like a drop to it, so you can't do it from super far. That's actually pretty nice. Nice little attention to detail there. I mean, Jack can throw pretty far, though, if anyone remembers the, uh... How far he can skip a stone. Okay. Oh, barrels. Forever doomed to be destroyed by gamers in almost every game ever. Oh, well. So, yeah, what are these glowing spots? So weird. Oh, does this... Oh, it just recharges my thing. Okay. I think it's what it does. Like it heals you, maybe? Let's see if I didn't forget anything. We should be good. Oh my god, the samurai? What is he doing here? Yo, sensei! <laughs> The Samurai? <laughs> I love this guy, dude. Yo, Samurai. <laughs> Come on. From that bar. Hmm. My shop. He's got a shop, dude. He's a, he's a salesman? That's awesome. Train with the Samurai and different weapon types to increase their damage and unlock new moves. Dude, okay. So I can buy hot water. Haggis. I'm guessing that's for a lot of health. Uh, potion of power, increases power, uh, shielding, more of those knives, shuriken, that's cool, a powerful sickle to throw at enemies, is that, are these multi-use or are they not? I'm guessing not multi-use, because you can buy quantities. Um, <laughs> imagine you sell your sword, you just sell it to, to samurai. Uh, ooh, okay. This I might want to do. Oh, that's a lot of gold. I think I'm going to save up for these the training of these weapons, to be honest. Oh, this is playing his theme song, too. Ah, <laughs> uh, Samurai. I'll dance with you. <laughs> that's so cool. Uh, the kid in me is very happy right now. All right. Gold, baby. Okay. That's a lot of gold right there. How much do I have now? 7,000. I think I can get trained in... Something in here. Uh, club training? I don't really want to use a club, though. Okay, well, I'll just hold on to my money for now. Again, like... This is so weird. I, I need to. I'll need to look up later what these like glowing spots are. I'm not really sure. Maybe it told me, and I just didn't realize it. I don't know. Okay, where do I go? Is there something over here that I'm missing? Nope. Oh, here it was. I was like, where'd that tree fall at? It's over here. The Lone Wanderer. I love this art style. I know it's simple, but it's it works really well, I think. Oh, it's the Scotsman! Old friend? What are you doing here? 
Waiting to tear your limb from limb, that's what I'm doing, you gill hootin' idiot. <laughs> Dude, I love it's voiced by John DiMaggio. That's awesome. Oh, yep, he's <laughs> well, clearly under control. He's you know, like... <laughs> All right, looks like we got to fight our good old friend, the Scotsman. Oh, whoa! I can't grab him. I don't think. Yeah, he's too he's too burly. He's too manly. Oh well. Oh my God, that's crazy. Ooh, okay. We gotta block. We gotta block him. He's of course he's tough. He's like Jack's ultimate like friend, like rival. Ugh. Okay, well I need to clearly work on my fighting strategy here. I have a I have a health potion to use too, so let's go ahead and use that. There we go. Oh okay, I don't think that blocks it that well. Oh no, he's going rage mode. Let's be careful here. Oh, okay, okay, I can I can dodge that belly flop. I think I'm taking damage. My shirt's ripped off. Uh, I don't know if I'm gonna win this first fight. I might actually lose. Oh my god, I got so far away from that and it still hit me. Oh, and... Oh, wait, did I have another... Li I, oh, I had extra life, I think, or something. I must have. What the heck? Did I miss where they explained the extra life mechanic? Because... Oh, wow. Okay, so that attack... You just gotta get the hell away from him. He's going to rage mode again. Looks like he's even stronger. Alright. I'm really lucky I had like an extra life or something. I'm not really sure what that was. I love it's playing the Scotsman's bagpipes. Oh, come on now. Oh, come on. Oh, don't want to lose to the Scotsman. I mean, there's more. There's a. There's no. There's no honorable way. Else you could lose in real life. Oh, so close. What the heck? Oh, whoa. I'm, what is the, like? What are these effects that are going on with me right now? There we go. I beat him. I, I, something saved me there. I'm not really <laughs> sure what it was. But, uh,. Our friend is not looking so hot. I'm I'm looking pretty hot though. My shirt off. Yeah, destroy it, Jack. <laughs> He's like poking him. <laughs> Dude, I love this. <laughs> oh, what happened? Laddie? <laughs> what in Sam Hoot Willie are you doing here? You're a sight for these great big sore eyes, huh? Ah, come here, you. <laughs> good to see you, too, my friend. But I am not sure what you are doing here. This cannot be the past. Something does not feel right. <laughs> Whoa, okay. Is it gonna heal me or? Stage cleared, wow, okay, there we go. Uh, meet the Scotsman, nice. 
Okay, well that was the first level, I guess. <laughs> Again, not sure how long this game is, but I'm definitely gonna be playing it all for you guys. Okay, where are we now? If we're still in season one... But this is also time travel. It could be any time that we've known of. Oh, it's Aku, baby! Alright. Huh, why does that look familiar? I do not this. Where am I? Oh shit, here we go. <laughs> what the heck? You thought you could return to the past and destroy me! <laughs> <laughs> Aku definitely looks a little bit weird. <laughs> For sure. I have cast you down into a place with no future or past. A place between time. Between time? Here. Things you know. I think you know. May not be what they seem. And I control your fate! And the only hope of escape is through your death! <laughs> yeah, don't take any of his crap, Jack. Until we meet again, Samurai! <laughs> Aku! Aku! By the way, I am loving uh, Phil Lamar's performance as Jack. DiMaggio as Scotsman was great, and I still really do like uh, Greg Baldwin, his portrayal of uh, Aku. I know some people like it more than others, I think, I think he does a very good job. Mako's a very uh, tough thing to replicate. That that man's a legend, so. Oh yeah, this is where we save the uh, Scotsman's wife. That's why I recommend, recognize this fortress. These are the enemies they fight there. I'm not sure what season this is though, like two? All right, here we go. Oh, this guy's a little tankier than that guy out. Yeah, it's a new challenge. Uh, let me go ahead and check, uh... So I don't have any more recovery options, or like... Let me check... So I only have 700 to use. Okay, I don't... I can't buy a new ability quite yet. Rothschild's here too, what the heck? Yeah, chap. Celtic Demon's Arm Laser. Shurikens, nice. Uh, so do I do I lose those weapons I had before? No, I still have them. Oh, okay, I just have to equip these. Okay. So these do more damage, but I what are the what are the perks to using the shuriken? I guess we'll find out. Well, he died in two hits, so the shurikens can't be that bad. I'm trying to grab this guy. What? Come on, stupid loser. Alright. Whoa, whoa, alright. I can't use my ultimate. I need to remember when I can do that. There we go. Just grab. Yeah, dude, I'm loving it. Uh, the combat's pretty simple. I mean, it's not really too much to it. I mean, there's, there's basic combos and stuff. Cut that guy in half. Okay. Scotsman's here. I wonder if we're indeed here to save his wife. That's what it is in the store, anyway. Better be watching out, laddie. I'm 
I must go find my daughters. Okay, I got a bamboo staff. Wow. I'll only last for a few fights. Close the distance on gun wielding enemies quickly. Okay, so yeah, let's go ahead and equip that, but his daughters, hopefully they're not like adults. That'd be so weird. Maybe it's like not points of time that we know of, but maybe it's like, I don't know. Um, maybe they're like super young right now. I don't even know. Let's equip that. Cool. Got my little staff. Bamboo staff. Oh, I love that little twirl. Good stuff. All right. Uh, let's go forward. Let's put the sword on for now. We'll use that bamboo as it's intended with the uh, long range enemies, as, as it said. Yeah, see, it's so weird. It goes like to kind of like a 2D mode here. Oh, there's a medallion up there. Whoa, no, they're adults. What the heck? All right. Uh, interesting. What's next? Always wanted to meet you. Haggis. Okay, nice. What's my health at right now? I don't think I can check. So weird. Uh, I'm not sure when this level takes place because the daughters are all growing up like they're in season five. Yet, like. The Scotsman's young? I don't know. Interesting. I guess it's not. You don't need to look into it that much, I guess. But kind of like how the original cartoon didn't have to make sense. Uh. We're ready. There we go. Your hair looks different. All right. Uh, how do I get up there? Like the platform, baby. Uh, and last, is there a way to get up there? Is there a way to scale the wall? I think that might be what I'm thinking. Let me check my abilities. It'd be physical skills, right? Jump good, okay. Escape throw. I don't think there's any, like, scaling wall abilities in here. Let's see jump good, though. Uh, L1, wait. While pressing L1, press and hold uh, X to jump good and jump higher than usual. You need a lot to buy that. Okay. Let's check out the other skills real quick. Spiritual. Let's unlock parry so we can move through the skill tree. Add a new samurai fist combo. You know what? We haven't been using the fist. Let's try to use that. Moving forward. Fist baby. There we go. Yeah, uh, I, might, I probably need to unlock a new ability to get up there. Unless there's like something else I'm missing. So. I'll go ahead and try to jump up here, I guess. Can I not get up there anymore? Okay, okay, there we go. Yeah, I'll come back later, I guess. Like I said, I'm going to do 100% this game when I'm done with the story and all that, so. Ooh, look at this. We got a line of beetle drones. Oh, come on, baby. Take you all on with my fists. use a sword. There's no reason to use the fist, honestly, for that those fights. Better be watching out, laddie. Okay. Uh wait. Am, am I missing something? Am I supposed to go through here now? Okay. Well <laughs> I guess I didn't even need to go that way. I think that I think that way was optional. 
That's good to know there's like branching paths for, this, for the game. What? <laughs> I kind of love these like random throws. I can, I can grab them and throw them. This game's very good so far. It's very delightful. Uh, it doesn't take itself too seriously, obviously. It's uh, just kind of a beat em up cartoon game, but. Uh, Seeing a game, a video game, like a high quality video game in 2020 about an old school uh, Cartoon Network like property? Are you kidding me? That was really weird. <laughs> Did it do that because I finished the fight or what? Uh... Okay, destroy the statue. Nice, thanks for the hot water. I appreciate it. I love, uh, I, I wonder if that's a reference to when Jack was in the, uh, when he goes to the place where the samurai eventually goes, that, that, uh, bar or whatever. You know, he kept asking for hot water. Obviously, he was just making tea, but, uh, I don't know, it's kind of, it's kind of delightful to think about they kept that in. Okay. Ooh, whoa. Let's use our ultimate. Because we're going to need it. Let's get it. Samurai Jack, baby. <laughs> I love this. Oh, you can just like jump and throw the shurikens. Oh, it's so cool. This game's just like mindless fun, dude. <laughs> I mean, I think you really do have to be a fan of Samurai Jack to fully like enjoy this, obviously. But like, I don't know. I'm just having a great time. I'm, I'm going to enjoy the hell out of this story. Oh, the shurikens are kind of nice. They're You just turn around, zap, zap. It's like bop them. Nice. Oh, there's more of them. Oh, wow, okay. We're going to dodge that guy. That attack, anyway. Trip you, beat you up. And slice you in half. Nice. Good job, me. Oh my god, okay, they got a big guy. Block that. The bigger they are, the harder they fall, and the bigger the glitch. <laughs> With that clipping through the body. Nice. Alright. Uh, before I destroy that statue, let's just search this room for gold. Whatnot, the goodies. I think there's also one of those uh, family crest things in here. If I remember, yeah, it's up there. Okay, definitely, I need to jump good, quote unquote, to get that. I'll have to unlock that ability later. I can only imagine, like, when you play through the game, when you unlock the abilities, you keep them for the next playthrough. That's probably how they encourage uh, replayability. You get all the stuff you missed. Take that, evil Akudor. Uh, which way was it? This way? No, it was... I think this is the way I want to go. Okay, so it looks like those little mist things just kind of give you a speed boost or something. What's next? Desert Oasis Jewel. If anyone remembers that episode, that's where Aku... Uh, pretends to be that woman that Jack travels with just to get to that jewel and destroy it, I believe. Okay, so it's good to have. Thank you. I appreciate it. Birgitta? I forget. I for they have a bunch of names. Like, the Scotsman has a segment where you literally list all of them. I think Birgitta is one of them.
Honestly, you can kind of come quicker with the, the shurikens. A lot of it. Look at that. I have 20 left? You kidding me? Oh my gosh. The ner nerf the shurikens. <laughs> that's, a, that's one way to take care of a fight quick. I, had, I still have 20 of them, too. It's good to know for the future. Shurikens are amazing. I mean, shurikens are already amazing before uh, I use them in this game, but you know. Treasure. Wood bow. Cool. Got it. Yeah, I'll equip the bow. Try it out. Oh, out of ammunition. Okay, I don't even have ammo for it. Well, it's good to have it, I guess, for the future. Oh, well, there we go. We have arrows. <laughs> I guess that solves that issue. Oh, we have to equip both these at once. Okay, that's good to know. It takes the spot of the shurikens, which is nice. Uh, before I go up there, is anything else down here? There's a ladder that takes me up there, and a staircase that leads to... Let's go to the ladder first. Not that I'm afraid of that giant swinging axe or anything, but there's clearly stuff right here. Oh, enemies! Oh, hi! Nice. Oh, that's so cool. <laughs> Dude, this game is just so cool. It just makes Jack look even like more of a badass. If that was even possible. I definitely want to learn the ability to jump good. Just because my inner child has always wanted to jump good. Uh, let's go over here first. I'm kind of the person that likes to explore all the nooks and crannies of these kind of games. Leave no stone unturned, so to speak. Guardian potion reduces damage. Okay, so it's a kind of a shield potion. It's good to have, I guess. And a third one down there. Okay. Why would it make me go back down? I don't know, but... Jewel of Neptune. Uh, the Jewel of Neptune is filled with magic and needs to upgrade specific skills. Well. I'm not sure what episode that's from. Uh, it might be the one where Jack is in the pyramid with the other guy who's also like who's like a thief, and they both compete for the jewel. I think it's that one. That would be season three or four. Kind of rusty on that. The samurai. Nice to see ya. Let's see what your store's got. Uh, some. Hmm. What kind of training can you offer me? I have some coins to use now. Let's go with the... Uh, let's go with spear. I'm kind of feeling spear. Spear 2 level. Or level 2. Okay. So I, I think I might have already been able to use spears, honestly. But it's just, it just makes it... Uh, oh, so the, okay. The bamboo staff counts as a spear. That's good to know. Alright. Dude, visually this game is so good. That's a great art style. I I really do think so. Fits perfectly. We're ready. Oh, they just call her Scotsman's daughter. They don't even do the uh, individual names. I guess that would take too long. Haggis. They love giving me haggis. I'll tell you what, so we got that way, and is there... There's nothing down there. Okay. Alright. Some beetle drones. I assume we're gonna verse these guys a lot, because that challenge is like... Wasn't it like a thousand beetle drones or something? Something crazy like that. Try to save my arrows. I didn't need to use that. Wow, I 
so much damage to that second guy, he just got obliterated. Whoa. Okay. Wow, alright. Time to go ultimate jack mode. Let's do this. So, that ability is really good, but it really only, like, takes out about five confirmed enemies, which is still helpful. So, I'm, I'm definitely glad it's in the game. You guys are getting their butts handed to them now, though. Got my... I think it does give you the buff, too, though. Like the damage buff. Using that. A lot of things I'll have to learn as I play. Oh, the hunter. No, those aren't the hunters. Those are the... That's the guy, uh... I think these guys... That guy appeared in Mad Jack. Where Jack had his, like... Alter ego, alter ego, like evil clone. It was one of the guys that kept pursuing Jack, and they kept making him mad. He was on like a bear or something. Don't ask how I remember all this stuff. I just remember when I was doing my season five coverage. I was definitely oh guns. Look at that, dude. Guns. Oh, that's so cool. The old school Jack never used guns. So that's kind of sweet. Um, but yeah, the only reason I kind of remember all the stuff is I, I did all those videos where I like reviewed all the seasons and I just kind of like remember it from all that. Uh, let's go ahead and try the gun, I guess. <laughs> that's, I, I don't know, that's just, that's just cool. Gun. <laughs> like he's just holding the gun, man. I don't know. Uh, hmm. Oh, I can aim it. Oh, that's awesome. Okay. Uh, I don't know how to... Okay, so I don't have a gun yet to use. I just have ammo. Makes sense. Oh, okay. These guys are ranged. This is going to be annoying. Can I headshot him? Oh, whoa! Okay, the arrow is like the coolest thing ever. Wow. That feels really satisfying to shoot them with the arrow. Definitely, I'm definitely gonna upgrade that. Revolver, there we go. So we got a gun. Let's go ahead and equip that. Just to try it out. Oh, I have it equipped, but where is it equipped to? It didn't equip though. Oh, cause cause the ammo. I didn't, okay, there we go. I think I have it equipped now. Cause I can't aim the gun, but I assume if I click, yeah, there we go. Pop, pop. <laughs> Samurai Jack, baby. <laughs> okay, so the gun's super weak, but you get you get a lot of ammo for it. So I guess that makes sense. Let's go ahead and put the uh, the bow back on. The bow is uh, the bow is just pretty sweet. Not gonna lie. I ran through that chair so fast that it destroyed it. Jack is a, a force of nature. Look at that. <laughs> I'm just little, I'm having a great time. Hope you guys are too. So let's climb this. Oh, the Scotsman's up here. Hey, buddy. Better be watching out, laddie. Jewel of Neptune. Thank you. Shoot a spirit. Nice. I will take that currency for sure. Here's some robots. Okay, so I can't shoot them. Oh, I can't shoot at them. I just can't aim that way. It's just weird. There's some Bushido spirit down there, but I don't want to go all the way down there for it. Jack does climb kind of slow, but that makes sense because there's plenty of scenes in the show where he's climbing slow. He's a methodical climber. I can't blame him for that. Respect a man who's got patience. Yeah, 
Yeah, so far this seems to be a very well constructed game. I don't see really any like noticeable glitches or hiccups or slowdowns. The only slowdown is when he hits someone, and that's just kind of for dramatic effect, I think. Like that's it's it's so consistent in the way it goes about it. It makes me think that. So the dash leads into some good attacks, like that kick kind of stuns him. Very nice. keep climbing here if I can seems to be something up here can I double jump up there uh, I, think I'll, I don't know I think I need to learn to jump good to get up there Buy more arrows, I think. I can only buy ten. Okay. Sold out. Okay, so he's got a max uh, quantity of those. Interesting to know. Oh, I can drop down on it. Okay. Who needs to jump good when he can fall good? Oh, whoa. Well. They're up there. I'm down here. I'm not going to go up there. Oh, we're going to fight something here. Yeah, about to say. Let's do this, baby. I should have saved this probably, but... I wonder what kind of boss fight we're going to fight here. This is clearly meant to be some sort of a... Oh, my bow's close to breaking. Gosh dang it, I should have bought another bow. I don't know if you can stack bows though. Something I probably should have checked out. I'm gonna save my bow. The rest of it. We're definitely fighting something here. This is a big arena. Okay, giant beetle bots. There's a pink one. Is this Mr. or Mrs. Beetlebot or something? All right, well, this is... I don't know what to do. Okay, well. I'll start by maybe firing some arrows at you. Oh, bow broke. Let's equip, uh, <laughs> let's equip the gun. Pop, pop, pop. Oh, wow, this is one way to beat him. I'll take one out with the gun if I can. Oh, whoa. Okay, nice. I finished him with, with uh, the scythe. Don't be so sure. Oh, I can jump off the body of the prior one. That's so sick. Okay, I'm out of ammo on that. What do I got left? I got a bunch of throwing knives. Okay, so throwable weapons are kind of like broken in this game. Like why like why risk yourself getting them in close to fight when you can just choose them with the, the throwables? Maybe there will be enemies that you can't do that against. Maybe they'll like block it or something, but these guys definitely can. That's like the perfect battle damage too on Jack, where it's like partially ripped clothing. Oh no, okay, so there's... They're getting combined now, great. Oh boy, okay. Oh, 
I would get in there close, but I'm just gonna take advantage of this while I can because my health is kind of low. Yeah, but throwables are definitely kind of borderline broken here. I love how my hair gets like undone. Uh, let's put the shurikens on now. Your time to shine. Oh, I blocked that perfectly. Okay, so he's blocking him now. Oh, there we go. Using block at the right time is very satisfying. Well, you don't you don't need to put a bracelet on the beetle bot. They're clearly already evil. That's not like he's been brainwashed. They built him. Ah, cool. I will escape from this place and return to the past to destroy you once and for all. Nice. Watcha! And it looks like another mission complete. Awesome. Took 20 minutes. Uh, yeah. I wish it said how many of the ultimate, or the, uh, the family things that I got. Um, so yeah, I'm going to end the recording session there. Uh, I think that's a good first episode uh for this series again i'll be doing the whole let's play for you guys the first episode will go up today i'll try to get another one out tomorrow etc etc um so yeah i hope you guys enjoyed feel free to leave your comments down below if you like this video please subscribe like comment all that i'm doing all this uh entire story so yeah hope you guys enjoy and until next time this has been mighty gazelle hoping you all have a mighty day see you guys